Rice farmers across Cote d'Ivoire have struggled to make ends meet with only one harvest per year. However, this is set to change with the introduction of a new program aimed at increasing production. Francois Casseyao is among the farmers who have opted to plant a new variety of the regional staple food. Today the yield is better with this new variety. Before we had other varieties and we couldn't get by. But since we started with the new variety, we are doing just fine. We can get four or five tons per hectare. I can truly say that rice nourishes us today. The national program aims to curb imports and achieve self-sufficiency in rice production by 2027. It includes better irrigation, mechanization, and improved short-cycle drought-resistant seeds. For this variety, we won't be talking about climate change. It's as if the weather has remained unchanged. When you plant it, whatever the weather, it adapts. It's good. It adapts to all climates. This variety allows you to do two cycles in a single year because the semi-harvest cycle is only 118 days. But if the farmer is really equipped with tractors or power tiller, he can do up to three cycles in a year. The country's production of white rice currently stands at 1.4 million metric tons. This is far below the national consumption of 2.1 million metric tons. In our projections for 2027, three years from now, we should be producing around 2,200,000 tons of rice. But all this will depend on figures gathered by the National Statistics Institute, which will give us levels of consumption habits and different varieties we consume. Based on these details, we will be able to make a good projection. The program is backed by a $552 million investment from the state and private sector. Authorities say this will reduce the significant import gap currently filled by countries like India, Thailand and Pakistan. Ian Kinyo, CGTN.